2019 day one it's me and Nicole and Adam they're up there I'll give you a better look at uh, Casper's and everything when we're not in a car and driving and standing but for now here's a look at this year's badges they're pretty cool it's like a whole squad thing like sort of Power Rangers esque but with different characters it's pretty cool all right so we are headed to our first panel of the day there's also going to be another test to see how many of these i start with the phrase all right it's going to be all of them anyway we're heading to a panel on um full metal alchemist and uh the science of actual alchemy so that'll be interesting right we are in the middle of the show floor uh so real quick uh cosplay breakdown nicole and adam are alex and zombieland and end the zombie from the webtoon uh Boyfriend of the Dead? Not, not I was gonna say it's, no, it's Boyfriend of the Dead. If you are not on the Webtoon app, you need to get on the Webtoon app. It's a like infinite free web comics and it's super great, including the one Nicole and I make called Eddie Mars and the Satellite Kids, which I'll link in the description below. Anyway, I am dressed as Han Solo today. I have a blaster, I got the and of course the stupid belt that he wears. So one of the best things to do at a, hey, at a convention is just wander through the vendor hall, I think, because you get to see like all the different people and all the different art, and it's really cool. Every year at Kineticon, I get a pair of these chainmail earrings from the same booth for $2, I think. Um, and I like had to step in and remember which colors I already have. So there's a really huge Pokemon meetup going on over there. So that's pretty cool. A lot of really good stuff going on. They've got three Detective Pikachus. All right, so we stopped by the food truck festival for lunch every year. Uh, the city does a food truck festival at the same time as Kineticon and a bunch of other things, uh, which is pretty cool. It's so fun to see the people who are like on break from work uh, alongside the people who are like from Kineticon. to the games hall. There's all sorts of different arcade games. There's some console games over on the other end. Uh, but it's just a lot of fun. Like even if you don't play anything, you just wander through. But it's getting really loud, so I'm gonna stop recording. Oh low great. We, hey, I'm trying to film here. Alright, so we are at our second panel of the day. It's our panel on childhood horror stories and movies and animated things in the horror genre that's for kids and stuff like that so that'll be really cool and really interesting also we're in like the front row we're right here so that's pretty cool okay there he is all right so last panel of the day before we head home it is on anime and the apocalypse and as it turns out it's in the same room we were just sitting in which we didn't know before we left the room and went downstairs again all right so we are heading home for the day uh, we're gonna go meet some friends for dinner and we'll be back tomorrow wow all right. <laughs> All right, so we were on the way to Kineticon day two. This time we have Ben with us. Hi, Ben. Hi. Wow. Wow. I'll show you cosplays and stuff when we get there and are able to stand up and are no longer sitting in a car. But we are super excited. Ah! Yeah. Okay. All right, so we are at our first panel of the day. Um, hi, Ben. Hey, I'm Nicole. <laughs> the panel is called... Um, Pick what women of popular culture or something like that. Uh, they do it every year and they update it with uh, what's been going on in popular culture, movies, uh, comic books, things like that. And really give and shine and appreciation to the women. It's pretty cool.
doing a late lunch today uh, because of the way the panels we want to go to line up. So we are in the vendors hall in pursuit of some snakes. All right, so cosplay breakdown because we haven't done it anymore uh, today yet. So Adam is cosplaying casual Adam. As opposed to formal Adam, like I did last year. Yeah, last year he was formal Adam. <laughs> So, and Nicole is Superhero Bulbasaur, which is actually a design that I drew up. So that's pretty cool that she's doing that. Uh, and I'm Squirrel. Here, hold on. Will you hold this for a second? All right, so we've gotten food. We've been to a few panels. Now we are wandering around the games floor for a while while we wait for the cosplay deathmatch later. So also something really cool, um, we just stopped to play um, a demo of a game that was created by two members of Alpha Psi Omega, which is the uh, theater honors fraternity that I was just conducted to last semester. So that was uh, really cool to run into them. All right, so we stopped for a bit to get something to eat. <laughs> they got pretty late, we wandered through the vendors hall for a really long time again. And pretty soon we're gonna go back through the games area like one more time and then we're gonna head up to watch the death match which is always a lot of fun. I love this as a photo. Day three. All right, so day three. We'll get to all this in a little bit, uh, but you might already be able to tell what I'm supposed to be today. Anyway, so I didn't vlog on our way out yesterday because I forgot to, but we saw the death match and it was really cool as always. The winner this year was Uncle Iroh from, uh, from Avatar The Last Airbender and uh, Bo Lin from Legend of Korra. So that all right, so we're headed to panel number one for today. It's about anime, um, about anime that makes you happy, I think it was. It was uh, something like Cheer Up Emo Kid, I think it was called, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we are headed there and we're gonna see what's up for now. We're just sort of making our way through the show floor, checking out all the different cosplays and stuff. Uh, everyone looks really great, of course, as usual. All right, so real quick, today we are uh, Team Titan Squad. Uh, Nicole is Beast Boy. Adam was Robin, but he changed his jacket because he got cold, which is fine. Uh, and I am Raven, as you can see by the all black and the gray face and the purple hair and the everything. <laughs>